for so long. I have a good reason. I got married. Yay. Um, we actually just got married on April 16th. It's been a crazy couple last months. Um, I know it's been several months since I uploaded a video. I think the last video I uploaded was my Trader Joe's haul for my Weight Watchers. I still am currently following Weight Watchers. I'm just really terrible at tracking my points. Um, but I actually started a new um, challenge for the next eight weeks. I'll be doing the Tone It Up Challenge. And it's for the Bikini Summer Challenge. Um, and I have been a Tone Up member for several years. I'm just terrible at following through. So if you would all pray that I will follow through this time, make it through this next eight weeks, I know it will be worth it. Um, the girls who do the Tone It Up program, Karina and Katrina, have some really awesome, awesome, um, <clears throat> they have a blog, they have an app, they have all these exercises you can look at in YouTube. You can go to the website, they have the weekly workout schedules, they have recipes, there's a whole Tone It Up community. I really um, enjoy the app and the community and everything in general. And I also, for the challenge, got me some Perfect Fit protein powder from Tone It Up. This is the vanilla. I had the cinnamon roll, but I ran out right when I was starting the challenge, so I ordered me some. It is Wednesday, which would be three days into the challenge, and so far I'm doing well. Just got my protein powder today, and the ingredients of this protein powder is very clean. It is pea protein isolate, pumpkin seed protein, vanilla flavor, guar gum, monk fruit extract, and sea salt, and they're all organic. Um, and I really like the new containers that they're putting them in so much better than the bags. I had the bag for the last one. I also ordered me some Perfect Fit tea. It's the green tea uh, that you can do with the challenge. They have one for the AM and one for the PM. I haven't actually tried it yet because once again it just came in the mail today. And I, just, I have not tried the, uh, I think there's seven of the Awaken and seven of the Unwind. And they come in these very cute little packets. So, anyways, on with my new Trader Joe's haul. Um, so, what you're about to see is my haul from Sunday, or no, Monday, when I was bringing in most of my groceries that I picked up for the challenge. So, I will get on with that. And be looking forward to some new videos coming up. I'm going to try to be more consistent. Um, my April favorites will be coming out very soon. And I am debating on doing a wedding video, like all the places I bought my decorations and all those things, because um, I thought it turned out fairly well for a very low budget. So if you guys would be interested in seeing that, please let me know. Also, follow me on Instagram. Um, I'll link that below as well. I put lots of food on my Instagram. Because I'm a foodie. I'm a total foodie. So I got lots of recipes that I put on my Instagram. And also I'll be posting my Tone It Up, uh, up uh, <clears throat> recipes and stuff that I fixed throughout the challenge on there. So follow me on there as well. Thank you. Alright, we're going to start with the asparagus from Trader Joe's. I really like the asparagus from Trader Joe's because it's very small. I don't like the big ones. They seem to get kind of soggy. But I got asparagus. I got some sliced mushrooms and some avocados. I got some uh, apples and these are like, um, these are a different type of apples. I can't remember what they're called. They say Pacific Rose, but I think it's just the brand. Um, but they were a different type of apple I hadn't seen in a while. So I got a bag of those. I got some flaxseed crackers and I don't eat those often, but I figured I may want a little snack because I'm fresh mint two things of bananas, some two bags of the Trader Joe's kale. I really like this one for some reason. Sorry to preach off. And the um, bag of baby spinach. I also got, and like I said, this is for the Tone It Up Challenge, the eight week bikini summer challenge. I realize I'm far from a bikini. However, you gotta start somewhere. I got two packages of the chicken breast tenders. They're already pre-cut. And these are pretty lean, like they rarely have any fat left on them, so I prefer to get those. I got some fresh ginger for my bikini bunch. 
I got two bags of the rice cauliflower in the freezer section and they also got two bags of the rice cauliflower in the produce section which I really like the rice cauliflower for um, you know making rice stir fries or whatever without the carbs and then I got the Trader Joe's uh, pico de gallo salsa for shrimp tacos tacos whatever I got the uh, unsweetened vanilla almond milk and I got the uh, original unsweetened almond milk to cook with I also picked up some raspberries some cooked shrimp I love this shrimp it's so tasty and it's it wasn't very much I think it was like $7.99 or something and um, these would be good for shrimp tacos I also got the shredded uh, shredded cabbage uh, the green and the red with the orange carrots in it I also put this on my shrimp tacos so good so take the shrimp chili lime Mrs. Dash seasoning um, coconut a little bit of coconut oil spray with this underneath on like a, a colored green wrap or even a, a tortilla if you wanted to do some type of tortilla with it it's really good and then I got a lime I also got uh, organic frozen mangoes for smoothies uh, pineapples strawberries and blueberries a Starbucks tumbler today so I could drink more water out of it I tend to drink more water out of pretty cups and then I got some rosemary some vanilla some lemons and I picked up a lot of fresh herbs because there's lots of fresh herb recipes this one is cilantro and I think I already showed you the rosemary also fresh basil because I don't have basil pesto quinoa I already have the quinoa so I didn't need to purchase any of that and I think that's it from Trader Joe's but I just wanted to show you a quick haul of everything I got and this will be the majority of what I'll be eating this week and some of this will last longer than a week so it'd be like a week and a half two weeks possibly especially like the frozen fruit will last about two weeks maybe longer um, the chicken will be for two weeks because I'll freeze one and make one for this week and then uh, like the avocados will probably last for two weeks because there's like four of them in the bag so usually only half at a time thank you so much for watching be on the lookout for my April favorites probably within the week and if you'd like to see that wedding video please let me know below and I'll see you all soon bye bye